We get a lot of questions around the brakes because we're adding performance to the car and more power, more torque. And along with that comes the requirement to make it stop better as well. Part of that question comes from the fact that people, when they think of electric vehicles, think about regenerative braking, which is an amazing tech when you first experience it, but is actually really, really simple. When you put your foot on the accelerator, you're putting you know, electricity into the motor and spinning it. When you stop doing that, the wheels are then spinning the motor and turning it into a generator that's creating electricity and putting it back into the battery. That energy need slows the car down. And so regenerative braking actually has nothing to do with the brakes. In fact, it's kind of the opposite. It actually saves the brakes. So when you're using regen braking, you're not using the brakes at all. And one of the things with drum brakes, one of the downsides is that they wear the way they wear and they need adjustment. If you're not really using the brakes and quite literally with regen braking, you can almost drive, the, unless you need to come to a really hard stop, you're braking with just, by just not accelerating, if that makes sense. So we can drastically reduce the wear on these drum brakes. And we feel, and we've got to, we've got to test it, but we think this, this is gonna be fine. This combination of original drum brakes that absolutely can lock up the wheels and stop the car, but lack feel, we bring that feel and that control back through the regenerative braking system and reduce the wear, reduce the need to adjust these all the time. Um, so it's a, it's a simple proven solution that combined with some modern tech can be, you know, can feel great and work great. And I, and I think that's what we're really trying to do with this whole vehicle.